Hey gang, welcome to another edition of Doc Schlock, where it's a review of the movie The Giant Spider Invasion. Yeah, this one's a re-upload. But, uh... Yeah. <laughs> well, if you missed it last time, I'm gonna redo it again, because of... Well, this and that. A meteorite is heading towards a rural, rural, rural uh, small town in Wisconsin. I can never say rural. Sounds like Scooby Doo with his mouth full of mashed potatoes. Where, of course, it releases a bunch of spiders, in which some of them grow to gigantic proportions, and they wind up going all over town, causing all kinds of trouble and havoc. And it's up to these two doctors named. Vance and Langer, who have to try to figure out how they get here, where do they come from, and how on earth to try to stop them. Well, they team up with the local sheriff of the town, in which he's not much help, because all he pretty much does is tell really corny jokes. So they wind up uh, Figuring out a way to try and uh, to try and close off uh, this gateway in which the uh, spiders came in on the meteorite, and they wind up uh, closing up the gateway, in which that causes all the alien spiders to melt in a very grotesque, gross, disgusting way. That will probably more than likely make you not want to eat oatmeal for quite some time. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, there's also a bunch of other different stories put around this movie to kind of fill up time for it, but uh, honestly, uh, the main reason to try to, that you're supposed to see this movie, of course, is for the giant spiders. And, um, but, yeah, the giant spiders are there. They go around destroying houses, uh, eating people, mostly Green Bay Packers fans. And, uh, yeah, so, yeah, so Dr. Dr. Vance and, uh, and Langer close up the gateway, the spiders melt, and it kind of ends on a happy ending, I guess. Because I think one of them winds up exploding and then kind of imploding and... Yeah, don't ask me. Anyway, uh, the movie starred Alan Hale from Gilligan's Island and Barbara Hale from Perry Mason. So, why did this movie suck? I will give it. I will give this movie some credit. The spider creature effects were actually pretty cool. Uh, they were actually really good. Some of them, not all of them. Uh... <laughs> There were a lot of gross-out scenes. Um, uh, spider goes into a blender. Uh, sp uh, one of the big giant spiders melting. Uh, spider eating, I believe it was a deputy. Uh, it was pretty gross, too. Um, oh, my goodness. But I think the, the real main reason why this movie was not, for, for me, not, not, a, not a fun time to sit through is because you could pretty much say that this movie was almost like a plot or a pilot, I should actually say, for a TV series because there were so many subplots in the movie it was hard to kind of keep track and after a while you kind of felt like okay, this is the giant spider invasion, where are the freaking spiders? And... yeah, I, I mean, I mean, some of, the, some of the gore effects for its time were pretty cool um, you know, you have mutilated, mutilated cows and all that stuff, and and uh, those effects were pretty cool. I'm pretty sure they were gory effects, not they didn't, you know, skin alive a bunch of cows. Uh, explosions, really weird, but but again, the spider explosion and then implosion, it just, just kind of blows up and it kind of goes right back, and I was like, huh? Okay, that was shot badly. Uh, yeah, the movies, 
the movie subplot is pretty much what made what made me just really not like this movie very much. I mean, it, it is a guilty pleasure movie, and and uh, again, if you have a strong stomach, you might be able to sit through it. Uh, but yeah, Giant Spider Invasion. I think you see maybe two or three of them in the entire movie, and uh, that's a, such a shame because you're you're trying to see a movie about giant spiders, and what do you get? Five or six different plots. So you're kind of sitting there going like, I came to see giant spiders, not some sort of nighttime soap opera bullcrap. But there you guys have it, a review of the giant spider invasion, creeping, clawing, crushing catastrophe. If you like my videos, feel free to subscribe. If you have a horror, sci-fi horror, comedy horror, fantasy horror movie that had an invasion of some sort, but it wasn't quite giant things, but you were kind of giantly disappointed in the movie, send it my way and I'll get on it ASAP. Thank you guys so very, very much for watching, and until next time, as always, stay strong and rock on.